Hi guys, thanks for tuning in Coastside Family Adventures. It is 7 a.m. on a Thursday morning and we are off to Canada. Come and go to Canada with us guys. Say I miss the fog, but I guess a foggy day once in a great while. This is the first foggy day we have had in what two months, three months, four months, five months, six months. <laughs> Are we at the border? I think the border is about one mile from here. Yeah, yeah, you're right, you're right. There you go. <laughs> Hey, we have never done this before. We never went to a different country in a car. I see Canada. So we are new to this. Okay, guys, we are in Canada. Oh, look, maximum speed. Did you see the sign? 100 kilometers per hour. So everything changed over to um, kilometers instead of gallons at the gas station. It is liter. Uh, the temperature is now 20 instead of 65 so everything kind of changed over and we are rolling towards British Columbia uh, Whistler it has been seriously really really ugly ever since we left Leavenworth so I'm hoping for some beauty here you know Canada needs to come through <laughs> it's a cool bridge though Kind of cool. Hey, still in traffic. Going inch by inch towards Whistler. Hey, it's starting to look pretty. Look, there are the mountains. Yay! Okay, guys. <laughs> Whistler, what is it? Whistler Village in in Suites. We're going in the parking garage. Oh boy. Do we even fit? This is sketchy. I mean, yeah, there's I'm... big trucks in there, so. Yeah, but oh, but the bike racks. What about the bike racks? I'll check. Too big? Okay, we made it into the parking garage. Seriously, guys, the parking garage was so low that our kayak rack actually scraped the freaking sign in the front. But the kayaks we left at home, then it was just the kayak rack up there. Thank God we didn't bring the kayaks, we wouldn't be fitting in here. So we got a pass for this garage, which makes it a lot easier because we are in the Whistler Village and everything is walking distance from here so we really don't need the car at all for the next three days uh, we're just gonna bring everything up into the hotel room and we're gonna chill <laughs> all right guys so we come into our room and the first thing I'm like there's no bed in here <laughs> but Daniel that oh, is. Okay, baby, it. open it and show. I'll show you. What is it called, Daniel? A Murphy bed, it's right? A Murphy bed. Look it. That is so cool. Here it is. Wow. Pillows are yep, pillows are all in there. Plenty of pillows. I got the pillows. I'm getting <laughs> Nice. Jeez, I'm excited. And then, of course, we have a sleeper sofa for the kids that is huge i mean that's like a king size sleeper sofa and we even got a little balcony look how cute this is whistler village Mom, wow and this is sweets and in and this is a blanket. 
Oh, good you brought your own blanket. What do you think, Jesse? Awesome! Yay! And there's a kitchen and a fridge! Yay! Nice! I love it! Happy. Yep, I can be here for three days. Mom? I'm fine with that. <laughs> okay, well, thanks for tuning in, guys. Three days in Whistler. Stay tuned for the upcoming videos because there's going to be racing and Whistler Village exploring. Um, our first time in Canada. So, thanks for tuning in. Bye!